This video is brought to you today by Genshin Impact. Stick around to learn how you can get free swag at their upcoming New York City Comic Con booth. Okay, first of all, I am extremely sorry that it has taken me four years to get to this. But yes, literally post dated either June or July of 2018, I have a whole bunch of fan mail here that I have never opened. Uh, <laughs> so first I have to apologize to all those people that sent me mail and it's taken me this long. So essentially what happened was, in between moving from Wisconsin in 2018 to New York City, Brooklyn, I had closed my P.O. box there in Wisconsin and I still had a little bit of mail that I hadn't opened up yet. So I packed that with all of my other stuff and brought it with me to New York City. You can probably see where this is going. Never fully unpacking in New York, I moved out of there after only a year and I ended up here in Richmond, Virginia, where then a whole bunch of my stuff sat in storage for about a year, and then my stuff sat in my apartment in boxes for a while. <laughs> the time has come. I want to see what's in here. Thank you guys so much for sending me this stuff back in 2018. This is going to be probably a throwback. Who knows what's in there? Let's get into it. We're going to start out with a thick envelope. This is from Aldrin. I think that's how you say his name. Uh, from Pennsylvania. Ooh, there's a drawing. <gasps> Yo! <laughs> Look at that. Rylu. Is that how you say his name? Rylu. Oh, and he's holding the Joy-Con. That's so sick. Thank you so much. Oh, what the heck? Did he send me a bunch of Pokemon cards? Oh my god. Oh my god. Bruh. Dude. Okay, first of all, the gold Mewtwo. I actually have all of these. That is so cool. I will find a perfect home for this though. And then, okay, I guess we got a, a pack opening here. They're all in sleeves. Let's check this out. Okay, energy. Crazy. Ooh, reverse hollow energy. Actually, that's pretty cool. Genesec EX. I don't even know how to say that. <laughs> Are you joking? Are you kidding me? Freaking Charizard? <laughs> Bro! Whoa! I'm not gonna lie, these are nice! Yo! Thank you so much, Aldrin, from four years ago. <laughs> I feel so bad. Alright, let's open up another letter. Um, what the heck? This is weird. This one doesn't have a name on it, it just says 2 Alex C and D. What? <laughs> What is this weird little winky face drawn on the back? A little. Eh. Let's see if I can do it. Let's check it out. <laughs> the heck? Um. What? Help me! I'm stuck in a lake again. Huh? What is it? Who's that from? Paimon. Wait, Paimon. Paimon, as in the one and only icon of Genshin Impact? The NPC who accompanies me, the traveler, throughout my adventure in Teyvat as my companion and guide? And the one that I had to save out of a lake or she would have drowned? That Paimon? Holy crap! I gotta go save her again! Was there a return address on here? There is! Return address! The Javis Center, New York City? Wait a second. I know where that's at. Where's my fishing rod? Okay, but in all seriousness, uh, today's video is brought to you guys by Genshin Impact. They wanted me to let you guys know that this October 6th through 9th, they're gonna be at New York City Comic Con. And guess what? Not only they are gonna be there, but your boy's gonna be there as well. <laughs> so excited. It was back in 2017, I think. I watched my old vlog. It was the last time we went there. I'm so excited to go back. If you guys follow me on Twitter, you might have noticed just a few days ago that I changed my profile picture to me doing the little, the little Paimon winky face thing, which is Paimon's signature look. So that's part of the hashtag being Genshin icon challenge, which you guys can participate in as well if you want to. Just take a photo doing the little Paimon winky face and uh, you can change your profile picture and tweet it out as well. But at Comic-Con, at their booth, they're gonna have a whole bunch of Paimon stuff. There's gonna be uh, paper wigs that you guys can get and so you can dress up as Paimon yourself. Or if you guys really wanna go all out, you can dress up as Paimon, cosplay as her, and then you can participate in the hashtag Paimon Phenomenon Challenge, which is gonna be happening at Comic-Con at their booth. Basically, all you gotta do is dress up as Paimon, go there, uh, take a picture at their booth, uh, tweet it out with the hashtags, show one of the staff members at the booth that you did that, and if you did that quick enough, and got there early enough, because there's limited quantities, you will receive a cool secret mystery Paimon gift that has a badge apparently, and then there's an acrylic stand. I don't know, it's kind of secret, you're gonna have to go check it out, but there's, again, limited quantities, so go there quickly. But yeah, I'm gonna be at the convention all day on Thursday, and I'll be at the booth in the morning there, so you guys might see me around, so come say hi and take a picture with me, we can do the pose as well. 
All right, let's open up the rest of this stuff. All right, this one is from Devin from Wisconsin. Dude, please, if any of you guys are watching that have sent me any of this mail in this video, please comment down below. Like, I wanna know what's up, where you guys are at, how it's been. Like, hope you're still around. <gasps> Another drawing? Holy crap, that's good. Custom Alex D&D Joy-Con grip set. Uh, I think Nintendo needs to make this right away. I love the Oddish. Oh my God. Yo, with the Kirby. That is so cute. Love that. There's more. Oh, <gasps> the best. Okay, I'm sorry. This one outdoes all of Aldrin's. I'm sorry. Oddish is just the best. Is there another one? Dear Alex, I've been watching for a while now and wanted to give you something that I hoped you would like. I decided to design one for you. Thought, hey, maybe CND would like a custom Joy-Con. So here it is. P.S. Look behind the Oddish card. What? <gasps> Bro. Bro, what is this? We always watch out. <laughs> Yo, that's so sick. That's amazing, dude. I love that. Wow. Dude gave me content for the video from four years ago. <laughs> we got a few more letters, and then we got a few packages. But honestly, I can't wait any longer. This package right here is from the one and only ACDC fan, who you guys might recognize from my chat on live stream. This man has been around forever supporting me. My man is amazing. This is straight from Canada. All right, let's start with the letter. Read all if you can. Hey, Alex, ACDC fan. It's been a pleasure modding your streams. Yeah, and he's still a mod on stream. Dude, this is gonna make me cry because Club Penguin and Club Penguin Rewritten are now both gone, and he's talking about how how I friended him on there. Still wearing the CND shirt with pride. I hope you make it to Canada someday, eh? Heck yeah. It would be a dream to meet you person face to face. Enjoy the orange puffle plush. How was E3, he said. Oh my God. Dude, ACDC. You are literally the MVP. My man's still around, still modding my streams. Holy crap. And he literally sent me an orange puffle. Dude, that's official. Oh my God, I love that. I got literally like the black, purple, pink, yellow, and blue, I wanna say. I do not have orange. That is so sick. Thank you so much, my guy. And then, Literally an original NES manual for Super Mario Bros. 3. That is sick, dude. Thank you so much. Okay, I'm glad there was nothing actually fragile in there. <laughs> Unless, the, I mean, he's very fragile. Precious cargo right here. All right, this letter is from Matthew from Michigan. From four years ago. <laughs> Uh-oh, it's thick. I swear to you guys send me so many Pokemon cards. This is such a throwback. Because, you know, I, I have never had a P.O. box since leaving Wisconsin. Which, comment below if you guys want me to open up another one again. I don't know if it would even be worth it. What is this? He sent me a little CND made out of Joy-Cons. And there's a little Pokemon pack there. Was this from like McDonald's or something I want to say? Dear CND, I really love your channel and I wish I could meet you. You are so, 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 so awesome. <laughs> I have a question though. Do you play ARMS or Fortnite more? Um, honestly... <laughs> Arms. I have not thought about that game in so long, honestly. What happened to Arms? So I guess Fortnite. Oh, and he has this Switch friend code, Fortnite friend code, and his YouTube name. Thank you, Matthew Wilson. All right, this one is from Sienna? Or no, this one doesn't have a name on it, but it's from Texas. Oh, dear CND, I like your videos, and I watched a recent one. I like Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, and my favorite is Battle Mode. My favorite battle is Renegade Roundup. It's a good one. I like Amiibo, same. I will end this letter with the C to the N to the D. Sincerely, Lance. Yo, thank you so much, Lance. I love that, I love that. Thank you so much, Lance. All right, next up, we got Jason from California. Whoa, what is this? Ooh, the King, the Kingdra. That is so sick, I love it. 2 and d from Jason. Go on contact, add a context, type in my Gmail. You'll be able to text me. What? <laughs> this man's trying to give me his contact info. Hey, it's Jason again. This time I actually have something for you. I hope you enjoy it. I love your vids. As you know, I also love you, as you know. Whoa. But I want you and Jacob and Jordan to come to my birthday party on August 18th. Oh no, this is an invitation. I'm late. I hope you guys can make it. Sorry about my writing. See ya. Dude, your, right, your handwriting is literally better than mine. A pin. There is a pin in here. Dude, that is beautiful. Dang, that's so cool. Thank you so much, Jason. All right, so we're almost done here. Just one more letter and a big one for the very end. This is from Lauren from Texas. We just got a letter. I am 14. I recently started watching videos and all of them had made my day. I felt ashamed for liking games like Mario and Zelda and Smash Bros and Fire Emblem. One day I found your video. If you're ever bullied for liking Nintendo, please watch this. I did as it told me and it gave me reassurance. So I wanted to thank you for making me feel better about it. Heck yeah, I gotta remake that video again, honestly. Probably would've quit my gaming life if I hadn't seen that video, so thank you. To return the favor, I drew you a picture of Toon Link from Legend of Zelda Wind Waker. I hope you enjoy it. Yo, that's 
cute as heck. I love that. I love that. That is what's up. Thank you so much, Lauren. I mean, I'm really thinking about this now. Like, if some of these people were in like middle school when they sent this, like 14, they're like in high school now or like graduating. They're like going off into like adulthood. That four years, that's like all of high school. This is, wow. <laughs> This is from March, from New York. Hey, we're going there, we're going there. I'm so excited, you guys. Ooh, what is this? A whole bunch of art. Alrighty. Dear CND, my favorite YouTuber. What? Thank you. Meeting you in New York was so fun. I had such a great time hanging out. I wonder if you remember the kid that gave you the enormous, I'm the biggest fan, PS, Nintendo forever, PPS. Club Penguin is alive on DS even after it was deleted. <laughs> Thank you, dude. All right, let's check out his drawings. Yo, we got the whole Mario game. We got Odyssey, Splatoon 2. We're on to three now. Looks like Mario's getting censored. <laughs> Puma, Link, Mario, Odyssey. Ooh, that's a vibe. I like that. Thank you, literally, like, Thank you. Thank you and everyone else out there that's still watching me somehow to this day. Thank you guys so much. You guys mean the world to me. Um, let me know if I should open up a PO box again because I'll definitely have fun opening it and do it not four years later. <laughs> There's so many emotions right now. I don't know you guys. It's crazy. It's crazy. All right. Love y'all. I'll see you later. Take it easy. C and D. I'm out.